Now, a bakery on Detroit's east side was robbed this morning. It's the second time it's been hit this month. On the Rise Bakery is part of the Capuchin reentry program for people who have recently completed a substance abuse program or were released from prison. Coco McAvoy live tonight in Coco. What does the manager have to say about this? Sandra and Devin, the manager Brian Talley is outraged and so is the community, both wondering why someone would target an organization that does so much good in the community. And now they have to look into extra security measures to try to end these robberies for good. I was kind of angry. As manager Brian Talley should be after yet another robbery at On the Rise Bakery early this morning. Came in from there, came right here. Came here to the register. Causing a mess that crews work to fix, cutting plywood and boarding up the doors of the bakery. Not able to replace the $100 taken by the thieves, though. Luckily, it wasn't that much, but it, it didn't belong to him. The bakery has served the community for years and is part of a program that helps people re enter society. We're not going to be defeated, and we're not going anywhere. But now the business has to worry about more security, and they're looking into Project Greenlight, the program throughout the city that Chief James Craig says uses cameras and technology to send a clear message to criminals. Not in Detroit, because what we do know is when you go to a green light location, commit a crime, you will be arrested. And Tally has a message of his own for the person behind the robbery. There's help out there. Get some soon before you get killed, you know, or end up in jail for the rest of your life. And Tally even went as far as saying the person who's been doing these robberies can join their program at the bakery. He just really wants them to get help. So if you know anything, if you heard anything, if you saw anything, you are asked to call the Detroit Police Department. Reporting live this evening, I'm Coco McAvoy, Local 4, back to you. And Coco, any idea, do they have any security cameras in place there? Yes, Sandra. So Tally said they ended up getting security cameras about a year ago when they started having problems. But unfortunately, the cameras did not capture anything from this morning's robbery. Mm. All right. Thank you, Coco.